Okay guys, welcome back to another episode of Beekeepers. So, um, I uh, got the buzzy boots off camera. So yeah, sorry, I didn't get it on camera, but I was grinding and I, I could buy them, so I did. But I got trash ones, of course, because, you know, classic, that's what I always get. So it gives a plus 10% white nectar movement speed and jump power. Pretty good, pretty good. So uh, yeah, and also I finished a bunch of quests. Still can't finish the candy one, even though I've been grinding in the fields that are supposed to drop candy. But still haven't got any yet, so I'm still stuck on this quest. But anyways, let's turn in um, Purple Butterfly's quest now. Here we go. Collection. Odd. Something is up with Angel Bee. Hmm, probably nothing. White is pretty good for collection in a well-rounded color. Another reward. Beeswax is next. Time for red. Nice, okay. Oh, I didn't get a beeswax? I thought it said it was gonna give me beeswax. Eh, whatever. Last but not least, red. Five red bees. Even more red nectar. Five red bees, that's kind of annoying. And nectar from all the red fields. Wow, what is this? Okay, the collection isn't bad, but uh, getting five red bees is gonna be annoying. Okay, let's um turn in exotic butterflies quest. Great job, you're better than I expected. I'll have to make these quests even tougher. Well, the special award was this Mystic Jelly. Ooh, it guarantees a mystical bee from breeding. Along with that, a generous jar of honey. And then, plus 2% nectar value boost. Keep coming back for more of that value boost. I've also got more goodies in store for you. Bye. Nice, I got a Mystic Jelly. That is really nice. Hey again. Daisies are delightful. Let's collect some. In the daisy field, there's all three colors of nectar. I'm going to need a lot of each. Could you collect some during the day, too? They're going to be so amazing. Well, off you go. Get me those daisies. So, I have dirt level 20. already done that. Ooh, if, if like the next one requires higher than level 20, I might not be able to do it. I'm only level 22. That's kind of a lot from daisy field. Red nectar and blue nectar from daisy field, and then nectar during day. Okay, okay, let's get cracking on these quests then. Okay, let's see what bee we get from this. Ooh, frost bee. It's icy and icy, so both icy things. Encased in permafrost, this bee uses its misfortune to help you. Okay, cool. So that's a blue, another blue one, blue mystical. Oh wait, I thought lunar bee was also blue. I guess it's not. Huh. But anyways, what is uh what does this bee do? Frost bee. So frost touch grants plus 0.2% critical chance and 0.5% blue nectar per stack and decays every 1.25 seconds. Huh. That doesn't seem that good. So you're telling me that it only lasts 1.75 seconds before it like decays a tier? I better make these tokens really fast than if it decays that fast. Or maybe it like, gives you like 5 per token or something like that. I don't know how that works. We're going to have to see. Huh, cool. Okay, so I just picked up a frost token. It gives you a 20 stack of frost. But I guess it does decay every like 1.75 seconds. But it still lasts for like a minute total. Huh. Cool. So it just gives you some critical chance in blue nectar. It's a very small percent though. Okay, I finally finished this exotic butterfly quest. It was quite grindy. It took a little bit of time. He's collecting that much red nectar and blue nectar from a field that doesn't have that much was quite difficult. Awesome, thanks so much. I have another special award for you. It's still another jelly, but it's still better than normal. An infused royal jelly. At some point, it was infused with nectar. I'm not sure how, though. Isn't it great? Oh, of course. The 2% nectar value boost. Hope to see you again. Okay, nice. Okay, so... I had a bunch of honey, and I bought two more pirate barrels to see if I could get a better tier. And I got two more trash tiers. Like, come on, bro. At least give me one shabby. Like, come on. That was so annoying. Hi. I've got three similar quests for you. I'm going to challenge you to get red, blue, and white nectar. But not like the other butterflies would. You need to collect from every field. Even ones that you don't have much of that color. It's going to be so painful. Let's start with red. Good luck. Oh, my goodness. Let's see. 
Oh, that is so much red from all those fields. Oh, I need to collect more red from Daisy Field. Okay, these quests are difficult. I'm gonna step down and focus on other quests. I'll slowly do these quests in the background, I guess. But oh my goodness, those are tough. Finally, after 10 years, I finished the Fancy Butterfly quest. I finally forged another candy. That was so, that took so long. You'll look like you enjoyed that candy. Consumables are key to becoming a master beekeeper. Baker Butterfly can help you get more of them too. You'll have to make them yourself though. She only gives the recipes. Here is your beeswax as well as some more candy. Goodbye beekeeper. Nice. So what I got some more candy I can't see. And I got a beeswax. Greetings. We are back to mushrooms again. I am going to need you to collect your nectar from the fungus fields. And also some mushrooms too. Bees with good foraging power will help you out here. Good luck, beekeeper. Okay. What did we get? Many mushrooms. Okay, that's not that bad. That shouldn't take too long. Okay, I just finished the uh, purple butterfly quest. So let's turn that in. Great. The red has an odd effect. It seems to make some of them happier. But makes higher rarity bees more aggressive. Interesting. Keep some of them to defend you as you explore the mountain. Of course, the beeswax. Take some more royal jelly too. This should help you build up your hive even more. Nice. Hey, the fields aren't just black and white, or well, red, white, or blue. They can be a mix of all three. Your next task is to collect some of each, as well as visit the first mixed field. Purple pollination three? Nah, get that nectar. Okay, what we got here? Okay, so just some pretty easy collecting. And maybe we'll get another beeswax, so I'm just gonna grind that out real fast. Okay, I just finished the purple butterfly quest, so let's turn this in. Awesome job, tasty nectar, take this fertilizer. If you use it on the field, it'll make it grow faster and you'll gain more nectar. So it's kinda like glitter, I guess, with an added bonus that kinda acts like a sprinkler, I guess. The top beekeepers use it all the time to maximize their nectar collection. Come back when you're ready for more quest. Okay, cool. No beeswax, kinda sad. Alrighty, you're due for another beeswax. This quest is going to be a bit difficult. Are you ready? Yes. Are you sure? Yes. Okay, you said so. One million nectar? That's it, just a clean one million. Good luck. Okay, that's not that bad at all. That's like, Oh, two Phillips, I guess, if I have the, like, new B um, buff activated. So, yeah, it should be pretty easy. Okay, I just finished the purple butterfly quest, 1 million nectar. Not too bad. Wow. Hmm, maybe I'll have to make my quest even harder. You really earned this one, a big chunk of beeswax. I think you're going to be one of the best beekeepers out there. Keep training with brimstone butterfly and spend those skill points. Try focusing them on one color. It'll help you get the nectar. Nice. Wait, what did I breed? A beaver bee? Sure, I'll keep it. Okay. Hey, uh, it's time for more purple. Purple, 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 purple. Purple. Red and blue. Red, blue and red. Get me some purple. Cool. Cool. Okay, what do we got? Okay, just a bunch of collection. Okay, should be easy enough. Okay, I just finished the fancy butterfly quest. Let's hand this in. Well done. Use your mushrooms to make some stew with Baker Butterfly. I don't have the beeswax for you yet. I will give it to you once you've complete the next quest. Thank you, beekeeper. That will be all for now. Visit me again for a much tougher challenge and a chunk of beeswax. Okay. Hello again. It's time for a challenge. A fancy challenge. This challenge will be mainly centered around white. I hope that you can complete it. I will be really impressed if you do. Time for you to work. Okay, what is it? Fancy challenge one white. Okay, so a bunch of nectar from that. Okay, yeah, this seems pretty easy. I should be able to finish that pretty fast. Okay, I just finished uh, another fancy butterfly quest. It was pretty easy, but uh, yeah. Wonderfully done. That challenge must have been tricky for you. As promised, here is your beeswax. 
as well as a glow fungus scoop. It grants plus 25% nectar at night for 5 minutes. Save it for the next challenge. It will be useful. Okay, nice. And we got a beeswax. Nice. Welcome, beekeeper. I am preparing another challenge for you. But for now, I will need to collect some more roses. That's correct from the Rosabella field. I will need some red and white nectar as well. I am hoping this will take you uh, long enough so that I will have enough time to prepare the next challenge. Collect those roses. Like, so we, what we got here? Okay, pretty easy. Just some red and white nectar and some from Rosabella field. Yeah, shouldn't take too long. Okay, I just finished Fancy Butterfly's quest. Well done. That was just enough time for me to finish preparing the challenge. Did you keep that glow fungus too I gave you? Never mind, here is another few just in case you may find it rather helpful. Nice. Nice, some glow fungus too, that's nice. Hello again, beekeeper. It's time for your second challenge. I have another beeswax for you. Once you complete the challenge, you may have it. This challenge will require you to collect during night. Night begins at 15 minutes and lasts 5 minutes. The glow fungus stew I gave you will be very useful here. Time for the challenge. 1 million nectar at night. Okay. I don't know if I'll be able to do that in one night cycle. I might. It's going to be close though. And what did I do? Oh, I got a dizzy bee. Okay, cool. I'll keep it. It's a legendary. Okay, nice. Okay, I just finished a uh, purple butterfly quest. Let's turn this in. Purple. Thanks, beekeeper. My quest, my next quest will be very difficult. I hope you're high enough level to another beeswax soon. Have this do. Be sure to save it for the next quest. Bye-bye. Cool. Nice. Okay. Uh, here you go. I hope you're level 20 because you're gonna need to collect from the melon field. It's a great field. The flowers are red and blue, just like purple. Time for you to wreak some watermelons. Or wreck some watermelons. Okay, so just 1.2 million from watermelon field is kind of a lot. Oh, it's nighttime. I gotta start collecting for that quest. Hey, I finished the purple butterfly quest. Incredible work. That's a lot of nectar. You really earned this beeswax. Actually, for that, have this. A melon field boost. It'll grant 25% more nectar for the melon field. Now use it well. Nice. And we got our beeswax. Everything. Get me some of everything. You heard me. Everything. Well, everything you can reach. A bit of everything. Good luck. What we got? Okay, so just a lot from a bunch of fields. Okay, that's... I mean, it's not like a whole lot from each field, so it shouldn't be too bad. Okay, I have 20 bees now, so I can enter the 20 bee area, which has a lot of stuff here. Okay, so first off, we got um, Build Your Butterfly. We got a shop here, which we can get Sprocket Boots, which I need some stuff for. I'm going to save for those because they look pretty cool. And then we have Silver Watering Can, which I don't really care about the watering cans that much, to be honest. So yeah, I'm gonna save for those boots. 17 million is kind of a lot. Maybe I should have saved for those instead of buying um, seven pirate barrels, actually eight. I finally got a shabby one after I bought eight of them. After I wasted like probably more than those costs. <laughs> but whatever, I don't need too much more. What was it again? 17 million? I need a little over 10 million. I guess that is kind of a lot, but we got the teleporters over here so we can actually start repairing these now because we got builder butterfly and what we got over here what is this it's 30 levels to use that teleporter we got a new field up here and uh, we can buy mystic gorilla jelly 250 corrupt honey and then we have a 40 b area over there which oh that leads to the caves oh okay so you need 40 levels to go into the caves i guess okay well let's talk to builder butterfly Okay. Greetings, beekeeper. It's me again. It seems you're doing very well. I knew you'd succeed after all I taught you. Let me tell you about grading tools. These precious little things allow you to combine two pieces of equipment together, combine two of the same grade item with the right grading tool, and bam, you've upgraded it. The buffs aren't negligible, though. They do get very expensive. I'll be happy to give you some. Okay, cool. Do we just get a quest now? A very constructive beginning. Oh, wow. That's a lot for the first quest. 1 million from Bellflower Field and uh, 1.25 million from Cherry Blossom Field, which is the new field we just unlocked over there. Cool. Okay. 
Well, I'm gonna end the episode here because we got a lot done and we finally made it to Builder Butterfly. And I really like this area. I think this area is really cool. The clockwork stuff and the gears moving. And also the cherry blossom field. The visuals in this game are really cool. But uh, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And I'll uh, see you guys later. Bye.